Hey, what's up, guys? Justin Roby, co-host of Power Builds, here at probably one of the coolest booths. I, 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 you know, it's funny. I've been to Gamescom so many times, and uh, you know, they always have the super amazing uh, farming gear for Farming Simulator. Uh, every year, and here we are looking at Farming Simulator 19 with this fantastic John Deere massive trailer that me and my friend Martin are going to go take out for a spin after this uh, and see how many people we can mow down. But anyway, I'm here with Martin. We're talking about Farming Simulator 19. Martin, you guys had a big announcement today. What was that? Well, you just said it. Uh, John Deere is going to be in the game, the largest agricultural machinery company in the world. Okay. That's pretty big for us, yeah. Yeah, so uh, everybody who buys the game gets a free John Deere tractor. That would be cool, but no, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> but in the game, yes, uh, you can buy it in the game then, but not that great, yeah. So also with Farming Simulator 19, the, the new version, you guys are doing a big graphical update, and is that for console as well? Uh, yes, of course. It's also going to come to Xbox One, PS4, and we're going to do a major graphics update, how we call it there too. So lots of post-processing effects, uh, which make the environment and the tractors look way more three-dimensional and realistic, but also um, like texture updates so that you can distinguish metal from plastic better. Yeah, so I got a chance, guys, just so you know, I did get a chance to take a look at the game. They showed me a little bit of the graphical updates, and we were looking at the big cotton uh, machine. What is it called, a cotton? Oh, yeah, it's the Case IH Module uh, combi uh, Cotton Harvester. Okay. Yeah. So module, really module Express, yeah. Wow, okay, I'd like, to say, I'd like to have you say that fast <laughs> 10 times. So anyway, we're checking it out, and they, they were showing me, as they were showing the graphical updates, you could actually look at the sunlight, and it was showing on the plastic and the metal, and you could see the differences in the materials. It looked really sick. Now, there are other new features coming to Farm, Sim Farm Simulator 19. What are some of those things? Horses and... Mixer style horses, maybe? Mixer, hor no, okay, maybe not mixer horses, but yeah, horses are coming to the game, what else? Uh, new crops, oat and cotton, we mentioned cotton already. Uh, oat, the horses need to eat something. And then we're also gonna have like a new weed control system, which used to be like a fertilizer system before. Wildlife additions, uh, so that makes the environment look more uh, interactive and realistic. So we got birds that are flying around, sitting down, picking up the seeds that you just uh, saw. And yeah, there's going to be much more that we read later uh, for the, the features we're still working on it, um, but we're quite excited about it. Yeah. And here's the deal, guys. I, you know, I know they have Farming Simulator and they're just doing it kind of behind, behind closed doors. It's not playable here. But if you get a chance to go to game, Gamescom, just look for the massive, massive booths. I don't think people understand just how big this game is. And I also know, especially for those of you who watch on Mixer, there are Mixer streamers streaming this game all the time. In fact, it was one of the, uh, it was one of the segments in the commercials we did uh, where somebody actually bashed through a wall with the John Deere tractor for Mixer. So it's super Super awesome. Um, we're super excited about it. Now, when does it come out? Uh, fall 2018. Like clockwork. And these guys want to get back and get to work on it because they, uh, they're they ready for it to get down, get into your hands, and to check out these new graphical updates. Guys, uh, we're going to go take off in the tractor now. Um, if you hear any screaming, just ignore it. Uh, you probably can't hear it over there in the South Hall, but we're going to go ahead and pass it back to you. This is Justin Roby passing it back to the stage.